bringing humanity back to healthcare is about finding that person in the patient. Sometimes we may overlook the human experience and illness, and I think it's so important that we look at it all together and make sure that we can treat not just the disease but also the person. When I first arrived here as the president of the Medical Center, I was so impressed by the spirit of caring and we're cultivating a culture of compassion. Ocean Medical Center for the second year in a row was named the number eight hospital in New Jersey um, and also the number 17 hospital in the New York metro area according to US News and World Report. And I think a lot of this is because Ocean continues to progress on the forefront of innovation but also this commitment to compassionate care. I had both hips replaced um, about 14 years ago or maybe 15. I think the thing that I found most acceptable and most wonderful was the attitude of the staff, the reassurance that I got, and the general care, and, and they tried to meet my needs. In 2012, uh, we were so fortunate to receive an exceptional gift from the Hirar Anana Family Foundation. It was a $5 million uh, commitment to the construction of our new emergency care center. That emergency care center was a centerpiece of the first phase of our master facility plan. In 2016, we finished the construction of a comprehensive cancer center. And we offer uh, the latest in radiation therapy treatments, expanded our capacity for inf our infusion patients. And now it's part of the Hackensack Meridian Health Memorial Sloan Kettering Partnership, where our patients have access to breakthrough cancer treatments. So here we are. Our newest project is an $18.5 million medical surgical floor, what I believe to be the most innovative patient floor of its kind that is uniquely designed to bring humanity back to healthcare. We tried to get uh, light and views of outdoors uh, wherever we could. Uh, we played with the color and the aesthetics to create a very positive patient experience. I think the, uh, the impetus of this whole floor was really started from, um, from John Lloyd and the development of this whole building above the emergency room, knowing full well that we were going to be growing. What a great opportunity for us to give an aesthetically pleasing, wonderful space to the team so that it can provide even another level of care for patients. The nursing staff and the team members were involved from the very beginning in the design of this unit. They were a big part in creating an environment where the nursing staff was brought back to the patient bedside. One of the greatest things that the nurses came up with was what we call our nurse servers. And that is a uh, design in which the nurses can access all the things that she would typically hunt and gather for. So she would need to leave the patient's room to go get. Also in our patient rooms, we have sliding glass doors that allow our patients much easier access to the bathrooms. These doors are designed in such a way that they slide open very easily so that the patients can gain safe access to the bathroom. The computers are set up in a way that we're facing the patient and that we can even sit down at the bedside with the patient on their level while inputting our information into the computer. So a few of the things that we considered when we were thinking about patient safety. One is the design of the hallway. Um, making sure that we could have visualization into all of our patient rooms. So the rooms are designed so that the nurses from the station can look right into those patient rooms. So I think the design it starts with some of the curves. You see some of the curves in the facility, which does a couple of things. It decreases the amount of noise. The noise travels in a linear fashion, so by putting those interruptions, decreases the amount of noise. The large windows, you know, light is health. And when we have these big open windows in the facility, it allows people to know what the time of day it is, know what's happening outside, but then also have that light streaming in and making them feel better about themselves and about the facility.
The facilities uh, in the Med Surge Pavilion are state of the art. They uh, will truly provide the next step in, uh, in care for the patient. We have uh, a lot more options uh, up here. They're going to be able to get out of here and go home a lot quicker uh, and uh, be further ahead in the rehab program when they do leave. The experience that you're going to have here, you will be amazed. The staff is so well educated and so prepared and the units are so set up for your convenience. Walking in here, you wouldn't even know this is a hospital. It looks like a hotel. I would have no problem having my family member have care in this facility. You don't get that many opportunities to um, create something from scratch. Health systems around the country are delivering a more human experience and we've been able to borrow from each of those lessons and incorporate that into this patient floor. I would tell a patient who was coming here for the first time that they're going to see something that will change their perception of what healthcare means and how it can be delivered. And they're going to see people who are just energized and want to deliver that care to every patient as if they were family.